about to wash this Dominican blowout out in this ponytail right now. And it got really frizzy as you can tell. Like in the middle, some of it curled up. And if you look at my ends and the back of my hair, you'll see that it is frizzy. Alright, so here we go. I'm about to go ahead and stick my head under this water to see exactly what happens. I'm going to use my I Am Moisturizing Shampoo. I used to use this when I um, first cut off my hair. And my sample size of Honey Hip Conditioner. I'm nervous. curling back up which is good 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 but it's a loose curl which is weird but we'll see with the finishing product after I wash it it feels a little weird I don't know it feels different all right, so now I'm just going to go ahead and put this um, honey hemp conditioner on there. I'm going to do a deep conditioning treat. All right, so, so far, it completely reverted back. I'm noticing, like, right here, can you see that my curls pattern does look a bit looser and now I kind of have like these straightened kind of ends but let's see what it looks like after the deep conditioning treatment so I'll be back I'll be back. Okay, I just washed out that conditioner. And I mean, my hair, it completely reverted back. I don't really think that I have any heat damage. I might have a little bit to my ends. Because I noticed that some of my ends, like this one, are a little straight. Like these over here, but... Other than that, my curl pattern, I mean, it, it's tightened back up. So I'm okay with that. I didn't completely, I did not completely wash out that Honey Hem Conditioner because you can use it as a leave-in also. But I'm going to put in this Rare Fruit Hair um, Cherry Bark Banana Cream Leave-In. Um, also as a leave-in conditioner for the leave-in. My hair is soaking wet. So that's in. And I'm actually going to do a braid out. And because I just got that blowout and you know, I'm scared about my hair not being moisturized or whatnot. So I'm going to use my um, whip shea butter and my how to moisturize. Your hair video, this stuff that looks like mousse, kind of. When I wash it, I usually just detangle it as I do my twist outs or my braid outs or whatever I'm going to do with it. So this is literally what I do. I take a section. It's my knockoff dimming brush. I brush from the ends. Make sure it's completely detangled. 
So you should be able to brush all the way through. And then I'm going to take a little bit of this. About that much. Well, I guess a lot, a bit. I always put some extra on my ends. And then I brush through it again just to get that product in there. See how wet my hair is right now. Then I'm going to braid. Then when I get fairly close to my ends, about that much left. I actually twist because braid outs if I don't twist the ends then it'll actually leave my ends fairly straight so I have to twist them and just wrap them around my finger add a little bit more if I need to and so that's one braid but let me know what you guys think as always, thanks for watching. Love you guys. Please rate, comment, subscribe. Thumbs up. Thumbs down. Do you like it? Do you not like it? I mean, what do you want me to do? Bye.